สวัสดีค่ะ I'm Chef Bana from Taste of Thailand and today I'm gonna show you how to cook chicken ginger stir fry or what we call in Thai ไก่ผัดขิง Okay, let's have a look at the ingredients. First, the seasoning. As usual, this is for two people. So I have one tablespoon of cooking oil, two tablespoon of oil to sauce, one tablespoon of fish sauce. One tablespoon of seasoning sauce, two teaspoon of sugar, and some chicken stock. For the meat, I'm using 300 g r a m of thinly sliced chicken breast. For the vegetable, I'm using 50 g r a m of ginger, 100 g r a m of onion, 100 g r a m of spring onion, 50 g r a m of green chili. 50 g r a m of red chili, two cloves of garlic, and one Asian mushroom. In Thai, we call it head h o n o It means rat ear mushroom in English. You can get this in any Asian supermarket. They come in a packet like this. All you have to do just soak them in hot water for 15 minutes. One this side, they will come big like this side. Okay, now I'm gonna show you how to cut the vegetables. It's always best to crush the garlic first before you cut it, so it releases more flavor. Cut the onion in half, take out the end, and then slice it up. To make the dish look nice, I always find it best to cut the chili into long pieces. If you don't want it spicy, just take out the seeds, or don't use the chilies. Use red and green peppers instead. Cut the spring onion in half, and then cut them into one-inch pieces. Make sure you take out the root before you cut the mushroom up. Last of all, the ginger. Take off the skin. Slice it, and then julienne cut it. We ready to cook. Cooking oil go in first. Next, the garlic. Cook the garlic until it turns to the color to a little bit brown. And then put the chicken in. And then all the ginger in. Ginger in first before the seasoning in, just because we want the uh, the flavor of the ginger mixing in with the chicken. Next, oil to sauce. Sugar. b i t sauce. Seasoning sauce. You can see chicken nearly cooked. So the next thing to go in is a mushroom. Put it all in. Get 
Get the mushroom in first, mix it all together. Add a little bit of chicken stock, not too much. So your stir fry is not going to be dry. Okay, now chicken is cooked, so we're gonna test it. It tastes really good. So next to go in onion. Chili, chili. It's a really quick stir fry. You just have to cook in a really high heat. And then the last thing to go in is the spring onion. Put it all in. Do it. You put spring onion in last because you don't want spring onion to be cooked too much. We want to keep all the vegetable like crispy and taste good. Okay. And now we're done. Turn the heat off. Let's put it on a plate. Chicken and ginger stir fry with rice. All done. For more information about all the ingredients I use, please have a look at the info below here. Enjoy your cooking. See you next time.